An increasing number of global companies are pulling their factories out of China, and this is raising concerns that the trend could hurt China's manufacturing industry. With competition rising from other Asian economies, some say China has lost its position as the go-to place for global farms. Our Kim Minji reports. Japanese watchmaker Citizen recently shut down its factory in Guangzhou. More than 1,000 employees are up in arms due to the sudden layoff, but the company says it's part of its restructuring plans. Citizen isn't the only one. U.S. software giant Microsoft has also shut down its Nokia factory in Guangzhou and plans to open a new factory in Vietnam. And with its Beijing factory also slated to close, some 9,000 employees are expected to lose their jobs. Industry watchers estimate that before the Chinese New Year, more than 100 large factories, including ones run by Sharp and Panasonic, were shuttered in the city of Tungguan, one of the country's main manufacturing hubs. So what has triggered the mass exodus? Many manufacturing companies entered China two decades ago because of cheap land and labor costs, but that's not the case now. Also, the Chinese market did not expand as fast as companies had expected. What's more is that countries in Southeast Asia, such as India and Vietnam, are stepping up efforts to lure foreign companies. The U.S., Japan and Europe are also offering incentives, such as tax cuts and investment support, to encourage homegrown companies to come back. The trend has raised concerns that China's manufacturing industry, once driven by cheap labor, may be heading for a crisis. The official purchasing managers index stood at 49.8 in January, falling below 50 for the first time in more than two years, signaling a contraction. Kim Minji, Arirang News.